Hello and welcome back to yet another episode of Fat Kai Box. This is Gracie Izun reporting from Chumakitima where I'll be doing my box properly. Now my question is, how can the government improve employment issues in Nagaland? Now without further delay, let's get started with our episode. They can select some members or like from the youth and they can organize youth parliament. Uh, the youths can give their ideas how to improve the economy and everything, whatever they feel is required. I think that's the best idea I can give them. I think that's the best idea I can give them. I think that's the best idea I can give them. I think that's the best idea I can give them. I think that's the best idea I can give them. How can the government improve unemployment issues in Nagaland? I guess it, it depends like how the government uh, provides scope, you know, for different courses. Like uh, there are still there is still a potential for business investment and all. So if they invest more, if, uh, let big business or corporate invest in Nagaland, then like. We create more opportunities, youngsters, and even like for we have high example, we have the permission for high girls, but we doesn't have a building, uh, you know. So there are lots of like really, really paper mill, you know? yeah. We can reopen that, and it, it can also create a job for people that are graduate but unemployed. So I guess yeah, it depends on government how they invest our uh, the funds given to them by the center. Hi sis. Yeah. So uh, my question is, how can the government improve the unemployment issues in Nagaland? Uh, the government can conduct some workshops and some provide some job fairs and they can also help some small businesses. Uh, in my point of view, if we have to improve unemployment, we have to be, uh, we have to give more in, uh, importance on educational and industrial sectors. And we have to set up new schemes for the students and also for the uh, people who are graduated and still does not have work. And also collecting data through their point of view, which will be very efficient for the development of our Nagali. Well, that's it for today, guys. Thank you for watching Pat Kai Bus. This is your anchor, Gracie Izum, signing off with camera person Joy Arichal.